Hey guys, so I'm gonna show you can make a calendar event using the default calendar app on your iPhone. Now it's pretty simple. So you guys see the second app icon it says calendar. So press on calendar. Now once you're in this app, then you guys see right now I'm on uh, Monday, June 29th, which is today's date. But if you want more options, then uh, press in the top of corner. Uh, for me, it says June. And that goes further back. And if you want, you can even go further back if you want to see like 2019, for instance, just press again in top of corner. And now we have a bunch of uh, time frames. Now I'm going to schedule one. So I'm just going to press on June of 2020 and just press on uh, the 29th. Now, if I go to the 30th, you guys see right here, there's this uh, meeting. So this is an example. Now I'm gonna set one up for today, the 29th, and I'm just gonna press the plus button uh, in the top right. Yeah, so this uh, sets up an event. So I'm just gonna do making a video and you can do a vocation. So if this is like an actual vocation, it's gonna show up on your Maps app. But uh, let's just do just do New York. All right, so you guys, if you want, you can make it all day. So it starts at midnight, ends at midnight, but this is just an event for now. So I'm gonna change that. And then for starts, so just press on that. And from here, I'm just gonna make it, uh, let's do, yes, yeah, so you can only do like intervals of five minutes, but I'm gonna do uh, 340. All right, just make sure you have the correct time zone and then when you want it to end. So for me, it's gonna be one hour. Now, if you want it to repeat, you can do it there if you want it to be a recurring event. And also, so if you wanna invite people, you can press there. Now, if you wanna get an alert, which I would definitely recommend if, you know, if it's an important event that you think you might forget, then press on alert. So from here, you can do the alert like at the time of the event, five minutes before. Uh, I'm just gonna do at the time of the event. And I'm just gonna show you guys an example in a minute. So yeah, it should go off in, it's, like it's 3.38, so in two minutes. And you can also set up a second alert. And at the bottom, you can just write some notes. All right, so I'm just gonna add this to the calendar by pressing add in the top right. Okay, so you guys see on the calendar now, we have this event in uh, two minutes. Now, something you can do, so let me just go back. Now, if you want, you can also hold down on the calendar. And from here, you guys see we have, just don't hold down for too long. But from here we have the meaning. So just press it there to go directly to it. Yeah, you can also just go to today's date by pressing today in the bottom left. All right, so I'm just gonna exit that and I'll show you guys the alert. Yeah, so there's the alert right there. So um, I'm recording a video, but if it wasn't, then the audio would be on. So you can press it from here and it's a few more details. And if you want, you can delete it at the bottom. All right, guys, so hopefully this helped out.